My most unusual experience as a theater critic occurred at a production of Anything Goes in the Kirkwood Community Center. A heavy door being moved off stage during intermission fell on my head. That was 30 years ago. The current staging of Anything Goes at the same location is memorable for much better reasons. Michael Hamilton, the director for Stages St. Louis, knows exactly how to bring out the humor in the book for Anything Goes, which was rewritten by Timothy Krauss and John Weidman for a New York revival in 1987. The scenes between the songs are not a letdown from the songs at Stages, which is saying a lot when the score includes some of Cole Porter's greatest hits and when the performances are as delightful as the ones at Stages. I especially like the tap extravaganzas featuring Reno Sweeney, a nightclub entertainer whose gimmick is she is also an evangelist. Julie Cardia is a terrific Reno with a distinctive sound and an abundance of comic flair. Cardia and the ensemble make the title number a bang-up conclusion to Act 1, and they then top themselves early in Act 2 with a glorious rendition of Blow, Gabriel Blow. The choreography is by Stephen Bernouf, the musical direction by Lisa Campbell Albert. The romantic leads are socialite Hope Harcourt and stockbroker Billy Crocker. He stows away on the ship taking Hope to England to prevent her from going through with her wedding to Lord Evelyn Oakley, which will be more of a merger than a marriage. Mm -hmm. Brent Michael DeRoma as Billy and Heidi Giberson are an endearing couple. Dan Funati makes Lord Evelyn likable, even though he is too quirky to be right for hope. Bob Amaral is a stylish comedian as Moonface Martin, public enemy number 13, and Laura E. Taylor is irresistible as the quintessential gangster's mall. Whit Rockard is Billy's boss, Carrie Ely is Hope's mother, and John Flack is the captain are delightful in their supporting roles. And Reno's Angels deserve that name in the performances by Claire Logan, Lois Enders, Gabby Gamash, and Bronwyn Tarbotten. Brad Musgrove's costumes look sharp on James Wolk's Art Deco set under Sean M. Savoy's lighting, and nothing fell on my head. Oh, good. What a relief. <laughs> but what a great show Anything Goes is, and all that wonderful Cole Porter music. Let's hear some of it now. <laughs> 